It's a beautiful Sunday morning and uh, we're out on uh, what would normally be a Sunday long run. It's not, it's not going to be a massively long run today. We're running from Worthing to Brighton to watch the runners in the Brighton Half Marathon this morning. So we're getting a little bit of relatively speedy but not super fast running in. About 11 miles down to Brighton. No, not even that probably. On the way. <laughs> Um, I am going to be testing out the brand new Saucony Endorphin Elites, which are on my feet right now. And first impressions are that they are the closest thing to the Nike Vaporflies that I have running yet. Uh, so we're supposed to be running with uh, Fina and Penny and Amelia, but me and Charles are so elite, we're so fast and awesome. And they're so rubbish. And they're so Just rubbish. I ne Do I ever swear on my videos? Oh, no. Yeah, it's this is entirely Charles's fault and that it will be beeped out. Anyway, they're just coming and we're waiting for them because we're very nice. Uh, we're at Lock Gates in Shoreham here. Uh, still enjoying the Endorphin Elites. Very comfortable. So I've done 10K, 11K in them now. Uh, they are comfortable. I'm not getting any rubbing. Um, I'm not feeling like the lockdown is loose at all. It's nice and tight. I'm feeling a lovely spring off the, uh, off the um, plate, carbon plate. Oh, these shoes! Oh, wow! And, uh, oh, these are Swiss shoes, aren't they? Fina and Amelia will be going home and spending £250 on brand new slime coloured uh, running shoes when they get home. <laughs> We are having a fabulous day. Here's one of the drink stations of the half marathon. Just by the famous Hove lawns and coloured beach huts. Right, the whole point of us coming all this way from Worthing to Brighton is to see some of the runners in the half marathon. And here's our lead runner, well done buddy. And here's second place. Well done buddy. So first and second through in the Brighton half marathon. This is Sarah's friend, Simon. So that's the first three through. Yeah, first Worthing Harriers, Neil. Well yeah. yeah. buddy. So that's the first lady gone through. Second lady is not far behind. Second lady, well done. Good job. Well done, Gary. Keep it going, buddy. Keep it going. Uh, so Andrew was supposed to have an ankle injury, but there's nothing wrong with him at all. Right, it's the Haley cheer squad. Well done, Haley. Well done, guys. So that's our first uh, Harriers girl gone through, Haley. And we're about, we're about a mile from the finish here. So Brighton Pier is in the distance there. That's, uh, that's just before the finish, uh, which is on Madeira Drive. Same place as where Brighton Marathon finishes. Come on, buddy. Well done, Matt. Come on, buddy. So if you want to do a one hour 30 half marathon, you need to stick with this guy here. There's the one hour 30 paces. So all these guys are the guys who started with the 1 hour 30 paces and are dropping off the back now because it's, it's so hard. <laughs> They've got a mile to go. Clinging on, clinging on to 1 hour 30. What a Lorna! So that's Lorna, one of our final Harriers through. We've got a couple more Harriers to come, I think. 
Lorna's gonna, Lorna, I reckon, get about 135 there. Come on, Everett. Right, Everett. Well done, buddy. <laughs> Have you been to the finish and come all the way back here? All right, Dan. If you want to do a half marathon in 145, these guys are the guys to follow. These guys need to these get get back with the pacer. Get back with the pacer. Come on. Well done, guys. Right, final word on the endorphin elites, which have been on my feet for the first time today. Really comfortable. Comfortable, no rubbing. Um, the, the lockdown on my feet has been fine. I mean, I don't tend to tie my shoes too tightly, but um, I haven't felt that the, the heel has been coming out of the shoe at all. They feel um, like a high stack. I mean, they are a high stack. They feel high, but they, they don't feel unstable to me. Um, sometimes with the vapor flies, you can feel like you are a bit unstable. And uh, as I said before, they are the closest thing I've had to Vaporfly before that you've got the same kind of feeling so really like them at the moment just one run in them today but um, stay tuned for more information about the uh, Saucony Endorphin Elite right so our final Worthing Harrier is coming through this is Rachel well done Rach keep it going Rach well done And we think that's pretty much all the Worthing Harry is through. Now, Rachel, hopefully Rachel can get in just under two hours for the Brighton Half Marathon. Uh, it's been great fun down here. It's a bit cold now, especially when you've run 12 miles and then you're standing still for ages. <laughs> it's a bit cold. Um, if you'd like to see uh, the last time I ran a half marathon, uh, then click that link right there. And we'll see you for the next one on the start line next time. Take care. Bye bye.